Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to explain how to draw shear force and bending moment diagram for cantilever beam. Cantilever beam which has two point load, I am going to explain it. Okay, we have three steps to do. First of all is a reaction shear force diagram, then bending moment diagram. I am going to do step one, reaction. Okay, so the reaction for this one is because we have only fixed end, it's a cantilever beam, we don't have any other support, that's why we only have one end. So RA reaction at RA is, is going to be equal to total load only. Because all the load is acting and supported by one end. So it will be 2 plus 3 is equal to 5 kN at RA. Once we have calculated our reaction at point RA, on based of this number, this number we can draw a shear force diagram. As we can see that uh, this is acting upward, 5 kN, and these 3 and 2 kN acting downwards. Okay, so it will be 5 kN will go upwards. So this is roughly 5 kN here. Then we move on to point B will come down as 3 kN. Okay, so this is 3 kN. Then we move to point C. It will come down 2 kN. That's how our shear force diagram will look like. Okay, now we have to draw a bending moment diagram. So this is obviously a positive zone. In order to draw a bending moment diagram, we have to calculate bending moment at each point. Okay. Now, bending moment diagram. So, this is a diagram here, actually a calculation for that. So, bending moment at point C. So we calculate bending moment from right to left. Why is that? Because force are acting downward and they are trying to bend our beam anticlockwise. So, that's why we will calculate from point C. We can also calculate from point A, but the main thing ultimately the answer would be the same. I mean the diagram would, would be same. One diagram would be in positive zone, the other one would be in negative so, zone. So we are going to do a diagram which is in negative zone. Okay. So 2 is a minus 2 multiplied by 0 will be 0. Bending moment at point B will be minus 2 multiply by 1 sorry I draw I forgot to draw the length of beam so it's 1 meter here and we have 2 meter in here so the length of beam is totally 3 meter okay so bending moment at point A is 2 multiplied by 0 because we have no distance and the force rotated around this point bending moment at point C minus 2 multiplied by 3 minus is because the force is acting downwards so it will be minus 2 kN. Bending moment at point A. So it will be minus 2 multiplied by 3. The whole distance of the beam to get to point A. Then minus 3 multiplied by 2. 2 multiplied by 3. 3 multiplied by 2. So it will be minus 6 again. Minus 6 is equal to minus 6. 12 kN. So now we have to draw a diagram based on these numbers. So at point C we have 0. So this is C, this is point B and this is point A. At point B we have minus 2. So minus 2 I will say roughly somewhere here. So this is 0 kN. And then at point A is minus 12. So minus 12 will be somewhere here. Now we have to draw the diagram while connecting these points. So it will be something like that. This is in negative zone. That's how you can draw a bending moment diagram for this type of beam. That's it for today. Thank you for watching my video. Please don't forget to subscribe my channel.